I'm gonna stop on my experience as I will install it again to show you how to install it. For everything, you need to unlock the bottle lock of the phone. Yeah, flash tool. Go to open flash tool and go to the option PLD. Connect the phone to the PC. Yeah, flash mode. Then request a code from developer.sonyobile.com Select your device from here Then press continue and enter your email to receive the code Like that you enter the code in the flash tool and the flash tool and unlock your bottle Second thing you have to install the ROM files you can install it from XDA developer from here or here android for iraq.com from here after that you have to install android SDK files from Android developer.android.com Select Accept and Select what Windows uh, What operating system you use 32 bit or 64 bit And then Select them After that you have The ATD bundle Extract it to Show this Open the ATD and select SDK. After that, open platforms. Platform slash tools. Next, I have to delete these files. After I install the uh, ROM file, extract it to open to show uh, this three files, boot system, user data. Copy it uh, to uh, SDK, last form slash tools, and select paste. Now we power, power, uh, power off the device. Open, uh, open here the CMD, yeah, uh, press uh, the shift key and right click, select open command window, power off my other device and connect it to the PC via fast boot mode. To enter the fast boot mode, uh, press the volume up key and block the device into the PC. It will show a blue light here. Now we have to write uh, some commands. CMD. First thing, uh, think. Write fast put. Then write fast put flash. But, but again, dot image. Now, to flash the but image. Then I have to put the system image. Uh, type fast but flash system system dot image. I will now wait the system flashing. Now writing system.
now finished last we type fast but slash user data again user data dot image this will uh, 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 format the device everything will uh, delete from the device now writing user data and now it's finished now unplug the device and power on it it will now show the sony and it will show the black screen don't worry it's but wait uh, for one or two minutes and we'll show the android logo and then start there are some problems in, the, in uh, this room for Xperia Z uh, it's uh, three problems uh, the first one it's uh, doesn't uh, you can't call anyone but you can receive a call the second uh, thing uh, the camera doesn't work and last some of google play uh, excuse me some of google apps doesn't work like google play and google play services and gmail gmail just uh, the yahoo mail uh, work but the google account doesn't work because need Google Play services and Google Play services doesn't work on the room. In Xperia Z1, the problem is uh, uh, the camera uh, doesn't work, Wi Fi doesn't work, Bluetooth and data wire, wire data doesn't work. Now we wait. Now show Android and now open. Now we swap, got it, go to settings, got a vault phone. Now Spare Z iOS P Android version 5. The charge is very excellent, is uh, very good. Uh, the speed is great Send house and other that's all before I finish the video I want to tell you that the, uh, the Z1 I will have one other uh, file it's cache when you flash put in cmd you have to flash cache in second the end system and finally the user data like this before we try we type fast put then type fast but flash uh, but but dot image then when it finish type cache cache dot image then we type system we type user data that's all I hope that uh, the video is uh, good excuse me for my uh, English, but it's the first uh, video I recorded and using the English language. If you like this video, you can uh, leave uh, a like and you can uh, subscribe my channel to see the last videos. Thanks to all. Goodbye.